Is there hope for a couple that hasn't had sex in 10 years? I'm Dr. Trish Lee, and I am here to tell you, yes, there is hope. But I'm a pragmatic optimist, so I have to tell you that there's lots of hope, but there's work ahead for intimacy to be built in the relationship, for sex to be brought back online with intimacy involved in it, and that's not gonna happen overnight. But what can happen quickly is that there can be a shift in your relationship so that there's a little bit more love, a little bit more connection, and that little bit could be a lot more than you've had in a long time. But the solution is very simple usually, but not easy. So let me tell you what we have to do. We have to get to the root of why that intimacy isn't happening naturally and why it's so difficult. Many times that involves shame, sometimes that involves secrets within the relationship, sometimes it involves trauma that happened a long time ago in childhood that needs to be parsed through. When we do that, building intimacy can happen more naturally, your relationship can come online, and then that can lead to more relational sex that is better than ever, possibly. So there's tons of hope but there's work ahead for that to be done. You need to get in care with a coach or a counselor who knows what they're doing in terms of intimacy and anorexia so that you can start moving forward today. There's no reason to wait any more, not one more second, if you haven't had sex in your relationship in 10 years. Today's the day to start figuring it out so that you can have happy days ahead. Okay, remember, control your brain or it'll control you.